Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. Uh, I mentioned a couple episodes ago uh, how a lot of Star Wars stuff will just like quote Star Wars like, hey, you guys remember Star Wars is, is the joke that people often say. Um, but like the way that uh, that happens is like there will be a thing that everyone remembers from Star Wars and that quote gets put into a Star Wars game. And hopefully you're like, oh, wow, I remember Star Wars. That's great. Cool. I love that. It's Star Wars, guys. Now that they have that, we know it. You know? Uh, but yeah, Keller Brimbor says, uh, so they have chosen death, like what Saruman says in the movie. And they didn't even have my favorite Saruman line, which is, well, you know, I like white better. But yeah, um, so like... One of the things about this game is, like, this game is partially meant to be a logic and justification for why Frodo was able to chill in Bag End and just have the ring, you know? Because in the movie, it, it looks like... Now, again, this is mostly going off of the lore of the, of the movie, which confuses this point. But in the books, in the movie, it's like it looks like a, a couple of days have passed. You can see a couple of days moving when Gandalf is going from place to place. And it looks like Bilbo's 111th birthday party is like right after or right before um, Frodo setting out and, and taking the ring and doing his stuff. You know, like the whole rest of the movie. But in the books, there's a 50 year gap between that. And that's not really talked about a lot. So how is Frodo able to just keep this thing in his pocket for 50 years? Well, it was because... Sauron starts growing after the 50 years in the book. But in this, the real reason is... Well, not the real reason, but one of the reasons is because Talion is running interference for him. The distance is so huge. <laughs> oh, you get back here. Mm, I'm quite a bit, so you must have imagined a lot. Well, ain't that a shame. Is, is somebody shooting me? See, this is perfect because I just wanted more guys. So thank you for sending me some more fellas, huh? I can't shoot him, can I? Yeah. Makes sense. But yeah, I feel like that's one of those things where like you don't really need to answer it, and like in the context of the of the game lore, like 
Oh, cool. But in the context of the game lore, like, I thought we were going off the movie, so, like, it looks like a day has passed when, when Gandalf comes back. So, does it really matter? But in this, it's like, why was Frodo able to just chill? Well, because Talion was running interference. A man able to mind control your army and make it essentially civil war itself is a horrible thing to happen to you. But it's a great thing to happen to anyone who's waiting on you. But because of the corrupting influence of evil, Talion, of course, is not around in the movies. Because he'd be too busted. And this sort of power set is, is the thing that is designed to burn itself out. It's why Sith Lords don't usually live that long. So that's an awesome line. She will have more for us. Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, how's it going? Being weird and evil in here? Or? Really should have thrown those doors open with two hands. It's like the best shot in Lord of the Rings. It's Aragorn just blowing these, do these, these doors open with two hands. <laughs> so hey in case you couldn't hear the growling of voice that's uh saruman doing his mind control thing just like he did on theoden king a little more active this time i will say and you can see also like theoden king she just springs right back up you know like one of those wilting plants my child I always like that her and Theoden King don't, like, just age back to being, like, 30 and hot. They're still old. They're just not, like, decrepit, you know? But again, this is also a point of confusion in the timeline, because, like... Isn't Saruman supposed to be good right now? Maybe not. Maybe I just don't know. No way that sword is long enough to do that. Or short enough. I have seen Sauron's servants. It's his non-broken one, right? And the black hand, they bring much suffering. If I was gonna say she looks a lot better now, but like, I guess prematurely aging like 30 years will make you look pretty bad. You know? It's one of those things. Like when you go to beauty tips, it's like lashes, lips, cheeks. Don't be aged 30 years in a single day by the corrupting influence of an evil dark wizard seeking to restore the power of... You know, it's it's a whole thing. Illness still plagues you. Rest, mother. But now the illness is just like menopause, you know? The White Wizard. In case anyone was curious or confused. With the power of the ring, he could have built a great army to challenge the Dark Lord. And that's what we must do. The one garrison does not an army make. Yes. We must dominate more war chiefs for a true army. So, I don't know if I've mentioned this, but I have not actually played, um... Shadow of War, which is Shadow of Mordor 2. Um, so what are we grabbing? So now we can actually look at these. Branding our orcs can let us go to other orcs and say, hey, tell them we got beef. Um, yeah, like you can see it in the menu. And the other thing is like, uh, it was in the trailers, which is kind of a shame, right? Because, like, now one of the coolest things in the game has been, like, okay, this is what I was looking for. It's an upgrade. Okay. Nice. Want that, definitely. Um, but yeah, so, like, a lot of people saw this, like, in the trailers or in pre-release stuff, and they were like, oh, cool. 
and then the game you know starts and they were like well, well how do i get it and like well you gotta play like you know because it's what episode nine where we get it <laughs> I wonder if the um I wonder if their voice lines change depending on if they just don't see you or if they see you and then get branded. That'd be kind of funny. You're about to get a very, very good promotion then, my friend. You guys are going to be my new guys. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I also got to hit a thing that allows me to... I'm just trying to get my, my mark off, guys. Can I please? There. How does that do you? Oh. oh, is that everyone? Cool. Oh, yeah. I should have gotten intel, huh? Actually, can we get intel off of one of yous? Execution. We sure can. Cool. Okay. Let's grab one of the big ones. Beldush Blade Sharpener. Afraid of being assaulted by a more powerful Uruk. And he's at Toll Crossing. Thank you. And we just throw him into the Nether Realm and he's not there. It's done to ensure that people that you get information from and then probably want to keep in your army don't just get killed right afterwards but it is just a little funny okay But yeah, conceptually, this is also just a really cool idea. Like, the idea of, like, an army comprised entirely of sleeper agents. And, like, you can actually dominate every single orc on both of Sauron's armies. Like, you can have control of every single war chief. And, like, no wonder the army's falling apart and can't do anything. They're literally not in control of themselves. Everyone in the chain of command is out of control. All right, who do we want? It's like a Pokemon starter, but they're both ugly green humanoids. Then I'll finish you off. Tumhorn Sawbones and Mozu the Proud. Slow, agonizing, miserable death. I think trying to fight. The thing is that they both have annoying power sets. Can I? Thank you. It's going to be a very interesting outcome regardless. Oh. Wow. Holy hell. Nice and easy, I guess. They're both up to being uh, 11s then. Ooh, I see some wimes in there. Night, thank you. I don't like the sound. Brave Walker. When I'm done, you'll be begging to be put out of your misery. Oh, he's got an apron on. That's clever. Ah. Uh, can't take his own medicine, huh?
Let's just clear these guys out. I don't really need them. What I need is their boss. I do want to keep the worm alive. Ooh, maybe we can just do it right now. This is Shrock. We will meet again, and I will have my revenge. Interesting. <laughs> Hope you're ready for a Another one. Oh, oh, no oh Nakra the Disgusting. Your name is sure right. Nice. As Grom the Skinner. Combat finishers. Summoner. And unleash his beasts. Interesting. And he's a gang leader. <laughs> oh yeah we got a gross one Ooh, you're a bodyguard that's convenient why don't we have you uh take out one of the little guys will you bulg drooler irritated by all that jumping about Get out of here, you. Awesome. So yeah, we can now see that like I like how this guy died. That's how I that's how I'm on my phone in bed, you know? I'm like him bum bum kicking my little feet, you know? I say little feet, but my feet are fucking huge. I'm six foot five. So like of course my feet are huge. They're just proportionate. I don't have like disproportionately huge feet. I I'll spin the camera because I know you want to see, but you can see that there's nothing there. I mean, maybe orcs don't have penises. I know that Uruks don't. Um, well, Uruk High in the movies don't because of how they... um. Because of how Urukai are made, they're just like born out of the earth. Again, another movie only thing, but like, I don't know what canon this is, and like, I like the movies, so. Man, I have had no shortage of interesting things to talk about. We had the war, we had the new Amazon show, Rushi and Tommy Tanaka are retiring. It's been a turbulent February, I'll tell you that for free. Now, granted, this episode is being posted in March. Oh, yeah, uh, I got Cuphead on the on the uh, sale uh, because of the show coming out. I love that, by the way. I love Nani Ikea Gelar Mordor. I already have this tattoo. You're going to see it. It says El Kun, um, which just means Elfin Prince, because that's me. Um... Uh, but I really love the phrase Naniki Gelar Mordor. And it is one of those things where, like, if you spoke Elvish, it would be a massive spoiler. But it's just, like, oh, we'll get there. We'll get we'll, we'll get there. Like, it'll be covered in the game story. This isn't, like, a Dark Souls thing where I may as well tell you because the game is, like, never going to say it implicitly. Anyone who doesn't fight doesn't eat! I really want to know what the food chain is like in Mordor because, like, I know that orcs are omnivorous. And they're fucking them up. Let's take out the archers. Man, imagine you're on a hunt and like six of your buddies' heads explode. You would not want to. You would not want to like go eat. I guess. I'll tell you that for free. Right, 
Alright, they got one down. I'm no easy target, he goes to say. This could be trouble. <laughs> oh, well, that ain't good. What filled him up, I wonder? Because he got a health bonus, uh, bonus somewhere in there. Oh, he can't be comboed, huh? How is his health meant to go down, huh? Oh, that ain't good. What? Surely that can't count. How about that? Does that do anything for you? Ooh, oh God. Really, how am I supposed to do this? Can you guys help me? No, those don't count either, huh? Sorry, I was trying to grab the other guy. I know that I can't do that to him. Damn. Well, now I'm dead. I love that the sword goes flying. Well, that ain't good. Getting a boost of power, no less. And he's dueling a guy. I feel like this game might have a slight bias for war chiefs that like you know about. We're seeing all these updates happen. Oh, two high powered archers. That ain't good. Not a big fan of archers, you know. And we've only got two guys in the ranks. Not good. And we died. Queen Marwen was possessed. That wizard was using her to get to you. Using her to build an army within Mordor. Sauron and Saruman both pursue the power of the Ringmaker. 
There can be only one Lord of the Rings. Hey, you said it. Anyway. Um, let's figure out where we're going. Crimp the gen- Ugh. I always feel kind of sorry whenever I, I do a whole bunch of, like, uh, plot stuff, and then I do, like, nothing after it. Because, like, you gotta watch the, the first part of this episode, but then the rest of it is all just me, like, grinding, essentially. And that's kind of lame. I mean, the game's good. So maybe not, but... I mean, this is like a gimme, right? I just want to go to the floor, please. Thank you. Man, swine! Are you here for me? Or just to snatch my grog? You're a murderer and a thief! I love the little hook on your on your thing, by the way. No, not tonight! How adorable! You tried it again! Oh, can we? Uh, cool. Now, we do have the problem of, like... We killed this guy, so now he's going to come back. <laughs> Humiliated by getting killed, yes. Break the chains of the Dark Lord. Cool. Uh, but yeah, we have a thing where, like... Now we don't know about, like... Sorry, before there was a problem of, like, we kill a guy and he'll just be replaced by another Uruk. But now we have a thing of we kill a guy, he gets replaced by our Uruk. He gets replaced by our guy, you know? Now the army cannot be refilled because we have new stuff in it. Oh, there's a thing. Hold on. Yeah, I've been playing Cuphead with uh, with my wife because uh, it was on sale because the show came out and it looked interesting to her. So she was like, oh, cool, let's play Cuphead. So that's a different guy over there. Mozu the Proud and Huda the Poisoner. I like I liked the duels because like inherently one of them will be stronger or like one of them will lose or die or whatever. You've betrayed your kind. Now you die. Release me now, and I won't kill you. Mm, the poisoner looks like it'd be a, a good thing to get on my side. Actually, if I could get both of them, a powerful enemy if he could be turned. Hello, hello, new army. Man, swine! If you're here to save these cowards, don't be fooled. They've got it coming, just like you. Oh man, if I can get two out of this. Wait, was that my guy? I don't know if it was my guy. Of course he is. Hello. Let's command him. 
why don't you, mon frere, go deal with some of the little guys? Get out of here. And like, because we are using orcs as they are, that means that we are now technically guilty of... Wait, 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 no, I want this guy. Oops, sorry. So, like, everyone knows, like, everyone and their dad knows that, like, just following orders is not an excuse. That's not a reason to do anything. That's a bad excuse for anything, you know? But the thing is, is that, like, just following orders is not an excuse, but giving those orders is still a bad act. Like, just because someone's following your orders to kill a bunch of innocents does not mean uh yeah clear out some more little guys huh oh that guy's so cool um and like granted we're not ordering these guys to kill we're not ordering these guys to enslave and you know cannibalize and poison and slaughter their enemies but the thing is is that because it's happening around us and we're not putting a stop to it and we're in fact using it and benefiting from it that means that we're now part of the problem you know now like I said this game ends poorly but I haven't actually played the second one but I also do know that um, there is a thing where like um like Talion starts becoming more of a villain and like I know that's kind of a spoiler but it's also one of those things where it's like it's in the trailers so I don't know how to judge it you know like yeah I know I'm not supposed to know that but like it's in the trailers for the next Shadow of Mordor so like you know whatever so um let's see where we got we have a war chief we have what is that? Three? We got three guys, and it looks like all of them are going to take care of someone else. Do we manage to get two? Oh, we got two in that last mission. That's kind of lame on our part. Um, but yeah, that's a good that's a good episode in my books. I'll pat myself on the back for that one. Pat myself on the chest, but don't mind that. Uh, but I've been offered this has been Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor. An excellent game. Uh, I will play this game to completion, as I usually do. I will play the DLC and I will play the sequel. Um, I don't know when those will be, but they're coming. Uh, but yeah, I had a good time today. I hope you did too. Have a good day, everyone. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.